If Siren Head were an SCP, which it isn't, but if it were, how would the SCP Foundation contain it? For those rushing to the comments to correct me about Siren Head actually being an SCP, hear me out for a second. Siren Head was created by Trevor Henderson in 2018. From there, somebody made an SCP document about Siren Head titled SCP-6789. This document was never on the official SCP wiki. Instead, it was posted to one of our draft pages, known as a sandbox page. Eventually, the amount of people mistaking Siren Head for one of our creatures was to the point that SCP Wiki staff and Henderson together decided to delete that SCP-6789 draft page. You may also notice that SCP-5987 is titled Siren Head. What's the deal with that? Well, the author wrote a story about a ship's figurehead that could control other ships with a siren-like song. Figurehead that's also a siren? Siren Head, you see where this is going. The author named it Siren Head as a meme slash joke about the controversy of Siren Head being mistaken for an SCP. Funny? Yes. Confusing to a lot of people who just read the title and neglected to read the actual article? Also yes. The reason that this is such a big deal? The SCP Wiki only allows submission of original stories and creatures, and Trevor did not submit Siren Head to us, nor did he want Siren Head associated with the SCP Foundation. Also, legally speaking, SCP creations are subject to the Creative Commons license, which allows reuse with attribution. And if Trevor wanted to hold on to his creature's copyright, he definitely wouldn't want to release it to us. Alright, so with the history lesson out of the way, what would it be like if Siren Head were in the SCP universe? I see this as being very similar to SCP-1000, which is Bigfoot, a similar cryptid creature. The main containment procedures, regardless of any other factor, would be making sure that people who saw the entity would be amnesticized or discredited, or both. And news reports would be similarly taken down or painted as ridiculous. If there were multiple Siren Head entities, or if the singular entity is nomadic and uncontainable, that is the extent of our efforts. Now, Trevor has tweeted that Siren Head is a singular entity, so the question is, can we contain it? Siren Head stories don't often talk about Siren Head's durability, because no one is really trying to take it down. But we do know that it is organic except for the metal of its eponymous sirens. Some sort of powerful tranquilizer could be used to knock out the creature and transport it to a secure location where it couldn't break out. If the entity can't be tranked, and can't be held in a building, there is hope that we could isolate it so it didn't interact with people. If it stays in one specific area, the Foundation could create a perimeter, falsely registering it as a national park or saying there's environmental hazards or some such cover story, turn people away when they approach, and contain the Siren Head entity in its habitat. And that sums up our hypotheticals. Siren Head is not an SCP, but if it were, that's a couple of ways the SCP Foundation would attempt to contain it. Got another non-SCP creature you want us to hypothetically contain? Leave it in the comments. And don't forget to support the channel, like, share, subscribe, hit the bell, and become a patron at patreon.com slash site42.